Pulmonary regurgitation is a condition that afflicts one of the valves in the heart in patients who are often um, in their early uh, part of life or, or in adulthood. It's, in, and it's, a, it's a congenital heart disease, which means it's something that you're generally born with. But it can also result from um, problems that develop uh, during adulthood as well. So, for example, there are a number of conditions, <clears throat> the most common being tetralogy of below, uh, which you're born with where the valve doesn't form correctly and it becomes leaky as a result of that or as a result of treatment for the valve early in life. So as adult um, physicians, we will see this in patients who have what we call adult congenital heart disease. Um, we at ANOVA have a comprehensive uh, heart program that spans the entire uh, life cycle of a patient from birth <clears throat> uh, to the late, later years. So we see patients from uh, who are uh, infants uh, to and neonates to patients who are older adults with this condition. The challenges historically have been that treating this condition usually has required open heart surgery, and uh, that can be obviously more invasive. But there are some interesting new develop developments over the last few years that have allowed us to deploy less invasive techniques to fix pulmonary valves that are leaky. And so pulmonary regurgitation is a leaky valve. And we now have uh, valves that can be implanted uh, through a blood vessel uh, in the groin uh, that can completely repair the valve without open heart surgery, facilitating early recovery and much less um, uh, invasion of the body. Chronic Harmony Valve is um, a valve that's come out uh, recently that has offered some unique um, characteristics that are really good for treating pulmonary regurgitation. Uh, at Inova, we were one of the first hospitals to actually use this valve in the commercial setting after it got FDA approved. Um, it's a valve that self-expands, so once we get it into place, it self-expands and it has basically a fabric or covering that allows us to seal the valve nicely, the old valve nicely, while putting in a new valve. So it's basically a stent that has within it a valve that self-expands. So as we un, uh, as we um, basically uh, release it, it expands into place and then completely replaces the valve in one sort of fail swoop. So it's a very exciting technology that has allowed us to treat patients with a much less invasive procedure, the uh, transcatheter approach than, uh, than surgery. And so it's expanded our opportunity to treat more patients and with less invasion. The Harmony valve is, is unique in that the, the previous valves that we had often couldn't expand large enough and seal well enough to get uh, the pulmonary regurgitation, the leak uh, adequately treated. We had other valve systems that were expandable through a balloon expanding system that were very good at treating narrowing of the valve, but were not as effective in treating a purely leaky valve often with enlargement of the outflow tract or the area around the valve. The Harmony valve, uh, because of its sizing characteristics and its good seal characteristics, um, and it's what we call self-expanding nature, which means it flowers into place rather than it being ballooned into place. Those characteristics make it uniquely um, uh, effective at treating this leaky valve problem that afflicts so many patients with uh, congenital heart disease.